Welcome back. Now, ahead of the elections in Telangana, Union Home Minister Amitya was there yesterday, took a drive at the ruling BRS, Congress and the AIMIM and dubbed them as 2G, 3G and 4G parties. Amitya, sounding the poll bugle in Telangana, launched also a scathing attack at his opponents, saying that the countdown has started for the corrupt and the oppressive Chief Minister K. Chandrasekhar Rao-led BRS government, which is being supported by the AIMIM. He also referred to those three parties as dynasties and saying that the Congress is a 4G party of Jawaharlal Nehru, Indraji, Rajiv ji and now Rahul Gandhi. It is a four-generation party as KCR's party is 2G party and OVC's party is 3G party and that none of these parties will ever come to power again. जवालाल जी, इंदिरा जी, राजीव जी और अब राहुल गांधी, फोर जंगलेशन पार्टी, केसीआर की पार्टी, पूजी पार्टी है, केसीआर बाद में केटीआर और एसी की पार्टी, पीजी पार्टी है, तीन पीढ़ियों से ये भी चल रही है, ना पूजी आएगा ना पीजी आएगा, ना पोजी आएगा, अब कमल की बारी है। well, the BRS and the Congress have now hit back at the Home Minister saying that he was daydreaming and that the BJP won't get more than a single digit numbers in 2023 assembly polls. Amit Shah ji was daydreaming that BJP will come into power in Telangana. They will be limited to single digit. And Amit Shah says that we are a 2G of you know party or something like that our schemes and the development programs that we have taken up in the past nine years are for generations and today their meeting is a big joke the meeting was you know kind of support to the farmers it is bjp government the central government which tried to bring in the anti-farmer laws in the country which brs strongly opposed and they asked to they had to withdraw them it's a big joke they know how many generations who are existing in politics today. Who is Jay Shah, who is Anurag Thakur, who is Abhishek Singh, and they will find out who they are, where they came, who are their parents. So let's not talk about that now. You are no party in Telangana because your party in the minds of Telangana people is already with BRS party. And here people of Telangana understood that BJP and BRS are having some understanding which is clear and cut. From then, in the last few months, the party has not been seen on anywhere. The MIM in this country, not only Telangana, everybody knows that it's a substitute party for a BJP.